So we're going to go into Dreffen it. is the grandpa that you play in a pickup basketball game, and he makes those wide open threes over and over again. Yeah. And just like, he'll defeat you in the weirdest of ways. Yeah, he'll double spot dodge right in your face. Right. Dreffen, definitely a no nonsense cheek. Well, I love that little wave dash that he does to just get more centered, and then he can react to the tech away. Oh, and he got the jump, and it's still going on the F tilts. Treffin. Added 30 more damage just by adding the little tilt, but none able to recover. Great DI by none, still living. Ooh, the ledge cancel. Yeah, the ledge you can't let none come from above. He's going to get these edge cancels every time. He's super crafty when it comes to mixing up his fall speeds. So, but Dravik getting a, getting the kill with no further serious damage. Ooh, I love how Dreffen just slid off there, preventing any more tag chase. But still, Dreffen has complete control, using the tilt really well. None's not able to get anything started right now. She's getting sheeked so hard. Oh! oh! <laughs> Dreffen. Okay, still got him with an up smash. Ooh. But these recoveries are giving him a little bit of a life, but it does not matter. Dreffen with an early two stock lead. He's looking crisp. Okay, what can Nun do off the grab? Oh, and he gets a knee. Yeah, you gotta hit that tech if yeah. you're Dreffen on the side platform. And Great Dreffen's, conversion by Nun. Dreffen's upset with himself. He missed the tech and it gave Nun the easy follow up. Oh, look at that. Instead of double jabbing, he does single jab into F till, expecting the SDI up. Dreffin's staying, uh, you know, he's been around a long yeah. time, but he has still got it. Uh, Dreffin was the guy that... Oh, oh <laughs> where are you going? Dreffin's the guy I used to model my Sheik off of. Very simple, rock, paper, scissors, smart. Doesn't look pretty, though. No, it does not, but, you know, who cares if it looks pretty as long as you're up on the scoreboard, which Dreffin still is. This game is all about stocks. All right. Whoa, all right, none. Okay. Oh, oh good experience. delay. That could have been a gift cap moment. And now it's still right back into it. All he needed was one knee and it have been pretty much a tie tie game. And okay, Dreffin. Oh, wow. And that looked, although none had his moments, it looked very simple for yeah. Dreffin. Stuck to the tilts. Did a great job of using aerials on uh, whether he was coming from above or below. You know, he did a good job of even reacting on the little things. Like I said, the, the jab and SDI mix-ups that Nun is usually really good at doing. Dreffin just had an answer for it, so he gets game one. Yeah. And I think the impressive thing was Dreffin's decision to when to tilt because many Sheiks can spam tilt and they get caught by Falcon's dash dance. He timed it and was just patient enough that the Falcon ate it and got punished. Now, Here we go. Nun is doing a good job making it really difficult for Dreffin to land. So that was something we, we actually didn't see like at all from Dreffin in game one was any of those silly spot dodges that we're sort of accustomed to seeing from him. Yeah, you don't actually want to spot dodge in that, this matchup because you lend yourself to a 50-50 where instead of them going for a grab, they can delay um, a knee and just knee you. Or stomp, which is even worse. Traffic, just the bread, like the bread and butter combos. Now, none has position. Yeah, you can't jab after an aerial on Falcon because if they stomp, you're done. All right, so none does get the edge guard, cleans it up. So that's what happens when you're a little bit lazy on the F tilt. They can just grab you if they're really good on the timing. Well, that was a good spot dodge by Dreffin, but here we go. Uh, a combo opportunity for none. Oh, you said, get off me. And I think none thought he was going to get the ledge. Yeah. It's like funny because you're just pressing down, you're trying to press buttons, and it doesn't happen. It's like you're thinking two steps ahead before the first step has happened. Oh, and the crouch cancel by none. One of the best crouch cancelers in the entire game. Yeah. Um, it, probably one of the big reasons why he beat Mew King at normal was that crouch cancels. Well, she's being neat. Yep. Drafton wiping off his hands right now. He's really into it right now. Look at how animated he is. 
He's not looking too happy, and just even, you know, that force match still put on dis like a decent amount of percent. And Nun's been missing a lot of the follow-ups off the grab. This lead could have snowballed the balloon. Alright, just a little bit off. Yeah. Once should again, be, uh, this should be a Oh, and he doesn't oh. back here. Tricks his DI. <laughs> Maybe Dreffen was trying to go for like a landing. Even so, like, you know, why would you not just DI for the reverse knee? Because DIing for the, uh, the reverse knee is going to kill you. But even with that DI, the, the knee that would send you from far away, you have a pretty decent shot of surviving on Dreffen land. That's true. Oh, caught him coming in. <laughs> he said, get on the platform. Why are you coming after me in the air? Yeah. And. Not saying my my dare is better than yours. And, and Dreffen brought this back. Um, it seemed like Nun had a lot of control in the beginning, but Dreffen doing the Dreffen things, walling, walling Nun out. No tech again, and look, Dreffen not happy. It's like you're just like this beast on a plate when. You don't tech on a Falcon. Falcon's like, ooh, I'll take that. Nom, nom, nom. Yep. Very delicious. All right, so going to Yoshi's. Very interesting counter pick here by Dreffen. Wanted to limit Falcon space. I imagine FOD was probably the one that guy um, banned. None likes being in your face. All those. Ooh. Yeah, what were you saying? What were you saying about that knee to the face? <laughs> that knee to the face. There's not much more that can be said. I think Nun likes just fighting and skirmishing, so I think he's comfortable here. Oh, great double jump by Nun to avoid that up, the fading up there by Dreffen. Ooh, that was, uh, not oh, sure <laughs> it's Falcon though. He's a tank. Oh, but that one will kill. <laughs> you basically like use the down tilt as like a, a little like break. Come back here. Get in here and get this up smash. I, I think Ans uh, Falcon's a little bit high percent down tilt becomes so powerful in this match. Oh, with that grab and that is going to be a stock for it. That's a big call out on that tech. Although I like that decision because it, it beats tech in place and tech roll to the right. And what's happening a lot in how Nun's getting his opening is that Dreffen's throwing an aerial and, and Nun is just waiting for him to land and just dash dancing and grabbing him. So Dreffen needs to be a lot more careful about how he jumps because he's getting punished a lot. Oh, nice steel grab. But no punish on the fall off no tech. Oh, barely misses. This is. He's got to get this kill soon. I think if Dreffen. The other thing about Falcon, Falcon can make comebacks, but as long as Dreffen plays like reasonably safe and doesn't get caught out, um, he can take this. It's, it's, it's kind of a struggle for Falcon to get openings. It's Auntie gets opening that's disastrous, but yeah. it's Falcon. Oh, that was so nervous, yeah, that was so nervous about that. Right. Well, I don't know. He's got to be, and this should just be a... Whoa, okay. And Dreffen getting some help from the cloud. Oh, okay, the late wall jump, and somehow Dreffen's still alive. Oh, no. I'm actually shocked. <laughs> That's it. And good play from Nun picking up there. Uh, not the cleanest player I've seen from Nun, but no. just enough that um, he's able to take it against Dreffen, but not without its scares. Yeah, I mean, he... Let's be real, like he got bodied game one. Yeah, he got, he got whooped. And then great adjustments, uh, using the Dreamland space to his advantage. And then just, like you said, using the skirmishes, he pretty much, whenever he got that opening, he just pushed it to the yeah. limit. So good stuff to none. He's still in. Dreffen, though, uh, you know, top 64. Still nothing to sneeze at. Yes. He's good.